Okay, we we got to Yeah, I was going to say. Now comes the real moment. Oh, oh my gosh. Oh. All right, everybody. It's going to be a good day today. Um Remember, I think I mentioned it in a video a while back that uh, Drogon needed to go see the dentist. Well, Drogon went and saw the dentist, so we're hanging out with Montana Rock Mom, and we're slabbing monsters today, guys. It's gonna be a rock good day. Meat. Rock meat. Rock meat. Rock. Yeah, none of that like insulting <laughs> little stuff that we were cutting last time. Nah, Drogon will feast today. <laughs> so here's what's on the chopping block today. Literally. Um, <laughs> So I filled up a bag of rocks to take over here like months ago. It's probably in the summer, actually, now that I'm thinking about it. And uh, yeah, these are some monster agates and uh, they're gonna be amazing. I'm so, so beyond excited. So we have a monstrous, gigantic Teepee Canyon agate. Uh, that video link will be right here. Got some amazing ones. This one I think is even better. This is gonna be such a nice Teepee Canyon agate. Cannot wait to see inside of that one. We got this monster of a South Dakota prairie agate, which again, it's gonna be amazing. These things are awesome. They never look the way that you expect them to look. Then uh, very recently, uh, actually last video, I think, we found this weird like half petrified wood, half agate thing. And I'm excited to see what it looks like on the inside. Last summer we found this one, which is a very, very, very weird Montana agate. I don't know what to make of this thing, but I think it's going to be really cool. Travis, 406 Findings, gave me this one, and it has an amethyst pocket, so I thought that would be pretty. This one, I will bet my life on the fact that this is an iris agate, and I've been holding on to this for like three or four years, so I cannot wait. Mom, we are feeding him to drink. <laughs> I think when we were at the shop before I left, I said I'd eat my shoe if it's not, so let's, let's hope it is. Uh, this is going to be a nice plume jasper. Super, super dark mossy Montana agate and super, super dark mossy Montana agate. And then this is actually one of the nicest Montana agates I've ever found. And I cannot wait to get inside this thing. It's gonna be nuts. We had the good idea, we being Kim, <laughs> to start with our most dense stuff so that you know we're not like dulling out the blade before we get to the ones that are gonna be hardest to cut. So that being said, this magical uh, half petrified wood, half agate is gonna be, I think, the first on the chopping block. Let's see what this looks like. Oh, I'm so excited. Oh man, I think I see pretty. Are you pretty? I think it's gonna be pretty. Is that a yellow right there? Oh. All right, I just found the perfect spot. Oh, look at it glowing. Dude. That's so pretty. All right, where's the sun? I do see like even a little bit of green, like green, yellow, Where, blue. Where's the sun? There's the sun. Oh wow. Wow. Look at this banding pocket right there. That is so pretty. All right, we're getting another slab off, off of that thing because that's insane. You guys, this is crazy. This is a piece of wood. And if you look at it under the microscope, You'd never know that that's wood you're looking at. I'm gonna throw up some pictures like I did with the last one, but wow, that is insane. The agate in there is incredible. It's done. Let's see how this slab turned out. Big reveal. Oh, that's a big slab. Oh my, oh my gosh. gosh. All right, I'm just gonna go straight and set over. Let's get close-ups like right this second. Oh. You guys, you're not ready for this. You're not ready for this. Wow. Look at that slab. It's like, it's just crazy. So I'm gonna zoom in a bit. Look at how much agate is in there. And I mean, it's like, not chalcedony. Calcedon it's like perfect banded agate in there. And then it's got wonderful wood grain. That thing is nuts. But here's the, the other cool part. Look at how much of this rock is still left. Look at that. Look at the yellow jasper. I, I can't believe the jasper in there. That is crazy. That's wood, guys. It's a piece of wood with all that agate and jasper inside of it. 
I can't even. So yeah, I think we're gonna just be happy with this one slab and I'm just gonna polish this that. This plume jasper. Oh my gosh, what? I need to put that under the I'm microscope. I'm gonna say, right there. Yeah, there's literally plumes in there. What? Yeah. I have no words. Words have escaped me. That is insane. We're gonna go with this because it's softer and it'll give little little old Drogon a break for a second. <laughs> yeah, that was like a huge meal. All right, guys, time for the reveal. Three, two, one. <gasps> Whoa! What? Look at those fortifications. Oh yeah. Look at the inside of that one. Yeah, that is super pretty. All right, I'll set this up on my tripod so we can get closer looks. Oh yeah, look at that. Okay, so we're gonna do close-ups on the TB Canyon in a moment. But before we do, we're gonna load this up. And this is my uh, my iris that I've been holding on to forever. I really wanna cut this side. I do too. Okay. Oh, I'm so excited. I'm so excited. Okay, let's do it. <laughs> I can't wait. I found that thing like four years ago and I've been too chicken to cut it. Look at that TB Canyon agate. Whoa, my camera is freaking out because of the light. All right, sorry. <laughs> Get those fortifications. That is so, so pretty. And I'm gonna leave, I'd probably use this slab for uh, cabs or something. I don't know, I haven't gotten that far yet. But we're just gonna polish the rest of the rock. And you wanna know the crazy thing, guys, is this is the lesser of the two Teepee Canyons. The other one's way nicer. So yeah, we're gonna cut that iris agate and a few others, but yeah. I think the grand finale is gonna be that really nice Teepee Canyon agate. Bruin is trying to join us. <laughs> you see Chopper in the background? <laughs> How's that going for you, bud? Oh, there we go. Hey, big guy. Hi, buddy. Okay, guys, it's done. We got a few slabs off of it, and it's very, 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 very promising. I'm gonna have to polish it, I think, before we see very much iris, but it has, it's showing all the right signs. So I'll get some close-ups in just a second, but look, isn't that just beautiful? I'm just gonna bang around a little bit just to okay. make sure. Okay, so here are the slabs we got out of this one. If we get up close and get a light behind it, you can see, I, I have high hopes for this one. Oh gosh, that is freaking the camera out like crazy. <laughs> I can see the green from here. <laughs> I have high hopes. I think this is gonna be amazing once it gets polished. All right, so we're just sitting there playing with the microscope and we both just heard this like gigantic thunk. And I, I'm not allowed to see it yet. Is it, is it crazy? Oh, <laughs> whoa! Shut the front door. Oh my gosh. Okay, I'm excited. Look at that. Wow, okay. I'm gonna go put this camera on the tripod so we can get I mean... closer. That's amazing. Look at that agate, you guys. There's so much just amazing moss in there. Perfect white dendrites. And there's some, where is it? Where is the pocket? Where is it? There it is, there's green. Green in there and then nice clear chalcedony. That's gonna be amazing when it's polished. I can't even get over that. That's so cool. When I found that, I had no idea what to make of it. Had a feeling it was gonna be interesting, but I think it's way cooler than I even thought it was. All right, so now that we've gotten that done, let's follow on the path of rocks that I have no idea what to expect from and cut this monster prairie agate. That's, I think, our biggest, densest rock of the day. So once that's done, uh, Drogon can just, you know, take a breath and relax. <laughs> it's gonna be really pretty, I think. All right, my friends, cut well and behave. All right, let's see this. Whoa, that looks nothing like I thought it would. Oh my, look at that. That, I, what? Again, I say this all the time about South Dakota prairie agates. The outside is no indication whatsoever of what the inside is gonna look like. Thank you, by the way, Kim. Yeah, for holding that for I'm me. here for. <laughs> how pretty is that? Also, can you flip it for a second? Look at how much more of that agate is there. <laughs> That's a massive prairie agate. Massive. But again, I mean, you see massive. all the oranges and stuff on the outside, you would never expect it to be so white on the inside. 
But then if you get real up tight and close on it, there's like little wispy patterns, bunch of spots. There is some color inside, but man, again, I say the outside of a prairie egg, it is no indication whatsoever of what you're actually gonna wind up with. Okay, so we're, we're leaving this next option up to Kim. We've gotten through all of our random stuff, so now all that's left is Montana agates, and uh, that's the grand finale. We're gonna end with eh, one of those two. Either the TPK or the big egg. Yeah, they both are the grand finale. So, I leave this up to you. Which one do you wanna cut now? Let's do the dark one. Okay. All right, so we just finished this one. Look at that. I was not expecting a waterline pocket, nor was I expecting banding around it, but look at all the moss. Wow. And I didn't show the others yet, but we actually uh, cut three slabs off of this one. <laughs> we just kind of kept going. It's so pretty. Look yeah, at that. I like that a lot. Wow. Okay, I'm gonna get close-ups on that other agate in just a moment, but before, uh, yeah, we gotta load this up. Look, there's amethyst in this agate. And look at those bands. It should, should, because I'm telling it to, uh, be an iris. So we'll see if it listened to me or not. All right, purple, magical, uh, iris, beauty, legend thing. Uh, do your, do your thing. <laughs> Listen, behave. <laughs> yeah, yeah, just real time slow-mo. Uh, we just shaved the face to get, you know, make sure that we had a nice uniform cut on our first slab. And I checked it and it is absolutely, most certainly iris. And we just got our first big slab out of it. I'm so excited guys, let's check this out. Ooh, look at that. Wow. What a nice slab. That is a beautiful slab. And you can see the purple. Wow, check that out you guys. Wow, how pretty is that agate? But wait, there's more. See that little purple patch? There's some amethyst in there. But again, wait, we've got amethyst. But here, I'm gonna get closer because you gotta check this out. Not only is there amethyst in this agate, it's also an iris agate. Check that out. Wow, I love it. I'm so happy. That is one very, very unique agate, and I love it. And my camera is freaking out right now. I don't know if you guys are gonna see that or not. This is way softer though, so we're gonna give uh, Drogon a break from the Montana agates, which are brutally hard. So we've got this really beautiful TP Canyon agate, and it's gonna be amazing. I'm so excited. Are you excited? I'm so excited, I <laughs> it. <laughs> All right, Drogon, don't let us down. How am I gonna do this one-handed? Wow, just like that. <laughs> Do you see how impressive I am? <laughs> Sorry. You guys, it's insane, look at that. I'm gonna get close-ups on the other side in just a sec, but oh my goodness. All right, so we're gonna readjust that, and then we're gonna face this entire side up here, and then, yeah, other things will happen, I guess. So we're waiting for those that other face to cut, and in the meantime, uh, we decided that it would be fun to take that TPK nugget and put it under a microscope and it's the same. That is so pretty. All right, I'm gonna take some pictures of these and just include a slideshow, cause that's unreal. The moment has come. Dun, dun, I'm so excited. Okay, oh. I think I see some goodness. Wow. Wow. Oh. It is a rock. After all this time, we've confirmed that it is still a rock. That is crazy. There's actually yellow in there. Like, what? what? It's so pretty. And then look at this. So we've got this amazing pocket right here and then you just roll it over ever so slightly. Oh my God. <laughs> and you've got that amazing pocket right there. If you come over here, there it is. 
There's an actual wow. yellow fortification pocket. Like what? That's insane. I love this one. Yeah, I think that's my favorite cut of the day. But I mean, look at. That's amazing. Yeah, even the cutoff from that is like. I mean, look at that. It's crazy. Well, I am surprised that, you know, this happened because this never happens. And this is two times in a row, but we are now moving on to the final rock, which is this gigantic, amazing Montana agate. Now we don't have a whole lot of time, so we're probably just gonna cut one slab off, but oh my gosh, I'm so excited. It's been a good day. The hype is insane right now. <laughs> like we've been getting letters from people talking about how hyped they are for this moment, yeah. even though they didn't know it was coming. People have like taken off from work on their jobs and like, yeah. I mean, everything's on the line here. Like it really is like, this is like Super Bowl status right now, except you know, different. So we just heard the clunk and we are both like giddy excited right now. Oh. I'm so excited. <laughs> the moment of truth has arrived. Is it? Oh my, oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Let's get closer. Sorry, everyone. Oh, Theo, look at this. Oh, oh my god. Oh my gosh. It's a moose. It's a moose. <laughs> it's a moose. <laughs> oh my god. Wow. Yeah, we gotta get a slab off of that one. Look at that. That is amazing. That is so pretty. Okay, wait, we gotta. Yeah, I was gonna say. Now comes the real moment. Oh my gosh. Oh, look, look at it, it's that. like square. <gasps> that That's got a perfect square. I've never seen anything like that. That is crazy. And this had like water lines in the middle. Yeah. Thing. And that, look at how different these are. Last slab of the day. And there it sits. Looking promising. I'm excited to see this. All right, let's get up close. Oh, wow. It's a sea urchin. It is in fact a sea urchin, as Alexis just pointed out. Wow. That is a dark Montana agate. Oh my goodness. All right, we should probably wait and look at the other half till Kim gets back. All right, I'm gonna get close ups on that one in just a sec, but I have to let the suspense build a little bit, <laughs> so. Here's the slab that we got. Look at the quartz pocket, that weird like square seam of dendrites. But look at oh the color. God. That is amazing. Wow. Beautiful reds. There's litter, there's tubes in here. Focus please, sir. Sir. There's green in it. That's amazing. All right. But it just keeps getting better. Look at this agate. This is something else. Entirely. There's like eyes. Look at that. Perfect circles. Green. Quartz pocket. Tubes. And just insane mossy dendrites. It's like Drogon had a filet. And right, seriously. <laughs> Drogon feasted today. Yeah, if I zoom out, see this whole pile of rocks? This is everything that we cut today. And I'd say um, we definitely ended on an incredible agate. Oh, yeah. Wow. We, it was so long ago that we cut this amazing petrified wood that I almost forgot about it. So we've got one, and then epic TB Canyons, and then fantastic iris, which is going to be even better after a polish. Then yeah. mystery mossy goodness. Uh, this one Alexis did actually find. I didn't find was this one the moose? I found the other one. I thought this one was the moose. Said yeah, <laughs> at this point they all look like moose to me. <laughs> this is the prairie agate. <laughs> and then the amethyst agate, which also had iris. <laughs> you guys are making this hard. Beautiful TV Canyon. <laughs> Is it seriously? Oh my God, is it really? I thought it was like 10 o'clock, okay.
everybody. That was a fantastic day. We got into some just absolutely monster rocks. Montana Rock Mom, thank you so much for bringing me up. Let me come over and cut some rocks. That was just way too much fun. If you if you couldn't tell, we've been having a blast today. Alexis is, uh, thank you for being here also and making me aware of the fact that it's almost freaking midnight. I had no idea, so. <laughs> Let's. <laughs> Well, I brought a backpack full of rocks, and the goal was to get through them. And we, we did that, to be fair. I watched the new Br season of Bridgerton, not sponsored. Oh, I've been watching that. Oh, so <laughs> yes. Good. I, I love it. I'm going to just cut this now. <laughs> Let me know down in the comments which fight was your favorite. <laughs> We'll have links to various stuff up in the description. Uh, like and subscribe if you like this kind of stuff. I, we do it a lot on the channel, and yeah. Uh, when this video comes out, we uh, Maker's Challenge will be starting then tomorrow. This comes out uh, April 2nd, so tomorrow is uh, the third, first uh, day of Maker's Challenge. It'll be the third through the ninth. Check it out, go to Katie Did's channel, and um, Kurt which is Rock Counting Adventures. And yeah, it's it's gonna be awesome. So excited, there's gonna be some awesome projects to come from this, including Montana Rock Moms. <laughs> but yeah, I love you all and I'll see you next time.